The latest on the diagnosis and treatment of COVID-19, the CDC updating their list of symptoms for the disease over the weekend. And Dr. Aston is back with us to answer some more questions. And Doc, tell us about the symptoms that the CDC added to the list. Well, Michael, remember initially the symptoms were basically fever, cough, shortness of breath. Now I want you to take a look at this list because the CDC has added six more, ranging from chills to shaking chills. We call those rigors, muscle aches, headaches, loss of smell and taste, a sore throat. Again, we can think of this as a work in progress. This is evolving as we've learned more from case reports and, and doctors taking care of these patients. The CDC recognizing after some time that there's typical symptoms and there are atypical symptoms. And I wouldn't be surprised, Michael, in the future to see this list grow even more. And, and Dr. They're investigating a popular heartburn medicine to treat COVID-19. What can you tell us about that? Well, very, very early stages. This is not ready for prime time yet, but it's a drug called famotidine when given nine times the regular strength in intravenous form to critically ill patients. The thinking is that it works on some enzyme that the virus uses so far uh, through a very kind of global infectious disease detective work process with experts from Boston and China and Northwell system in New York and the Department of HHS all work together to test this again results not out yet but we will be following it hi everyone George Stephanopoulos here thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel if you'd like to get more videos show highlights and watch live event coverage click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts thanks for watching